So Morgan, um, tell me what it was like working with Ron Shelton on this movie. Who? Ron Shelton. <laughs> he was here yesterday, and I wish he was here today. So he's here. He's just doing interviews. Yeah, but he was in there, ah. so I could tease him. Uh, that, that was great. Uh, Ron is, um, number one, I think he's a very good director. Um, uh, not a bad writer. Uh, easy to work with. Very, very easy to work with. Uh, he's not anal about anything. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a believer in quick. Let's just keep moving. Let's get it done. Move on. He's a believer. So uh, we meet in the middle on that score. Uh, I enjoyed the character that I got to play. I enjoyed working with the people I was working with. So it was all good. Um, how, how, did you know Tommy very well coming into it? Know him, uh, met Tommy a few times, but been a fan of his since, I don't know, coal miner's daughter at least. Um, so know him in a sense, yes, yes. Um, it looks like you guys are having a lot of fun. Was it, was it a fun movie to shoot? Yeah, yeah, thought I said that. It was, it was a lot of fun. Uh, you know, you, you are set with people you admire, people whose work you've uh, applauded, and here you are getting the chance to dance with them. So it say, well, life is good. <laughs> um, well, it's it's funny because it seems to me like the whole the whole um, uh, group of people there at the at the at the Villa Capri are all having a great time, and it's almost like you know the way kids the way kids have fun at the beginning. It seems like you know the adults are yeah, having that kind of yeah, it's like summer yeah, camp basically. Right. Well, uh, you know, I, I, it's Duke's input. Uh, I think he in tended to make sure that his constituency, as it were, uh, had a good time. That's what they were there to do. You know, you don't come here to die. You know, you're retired, and it's now it's time to party. Um, comedy, obviously you do, you know, you do a lot of dramas and you do some comedy. How much dif more difficult is comedy? It's um, not difficult at all. I mean. Trying to be funny is probably difficult. I'm not. I'm not. But uh, acting is acting. It doesn't matter if, you, if if you've got a funny situation, just play it. You know, don't try to be something you're not. <laughs> you know, I'm not like the danger field. <laughs> um, and you seem to have some great chemistry with Renee. Had you had you worked with her or had you? I know we were in the same movie back in '95. But we didn't work together at all. We were never on set together. Uh, but since then, I have known her, you know. I mean, not in the biblical sense. Don't, don't, don't get that word, God. Uh, Morgan Freeman says <laughs> That's all. <laughs> and Tommy Lee, same thing, you know. I, I met Tommy on a, on a few occasions, but just admired the hell out of him over the years. So. And what do you have coming up next after this? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, there is, and it was a movie, but I got to do some reshoots on it, and it probably won't come out before next Christmas. It's the Nutcracker, Disney's doing. Um, and I think this is the last thing out for a while. And uh, your company is celebrating twenty years. It's about to celebrate twenty years. Yeah, and you're doing the, all kinds of stuff. You got Madam Secretary on. How's that been, doing your own stuff, and, and do you believe that you've had this company for 20 years already? I don't believe it, but it's true. Uh, and it's uh, now that we're moving along, it's, it's great. Uh, you know, when you start something like this, uh, almost every actor worth his seat on the bus uh, has a a company that because you know you, you start a company and then you can buy books or scripts or what have you but to have one that's functioning is it's really a feather is there some dream project that you want to do is there oh, some heavens, yes there were tons of them yeah yeah I mean for I don't know but the first thing uh, 
we set out to do. As a matter of fact, uh, Laurie and I went to Sri Lanka to talk to, um, what's his name? Who wrote um, Space Odyssey? I don't have to ask him anything. <laughs> uh, um, it'll come to me, then yeah, yeah. you know who it is. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's a great book called Rama, Rendezvous with Rama, about a visitation from out of space. Uh, and very well, he needs to, you know, he's a science God Jesus. Anyway, he's, he's a science writer. And, you know, it's, it's a lot more like science fiction rather than science fantasy. Uh, I'm trying to get that one done. Uh, Bass Reeves, 20 years trying to do um, a war movie um, about a tank battalion in World War II. Um, I would also like to redo uh, a movie, or not redo, but make a, a definitive movie about the Red Tails. Arthur Clark. Arthur C. Clark. Uh, uh, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Laura and I went to Sri Lanka to sit down with him because he, he said, yeah, you can, you, you can have it. And so do what you need to do with it. Because a lot of people had taken a lot of pieces from it, but they hadn't done it. So we wanted to do Rendezvous with Rama. It's still in the work. Well, good luck with all that. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank sir. you so much. Thank you. Eric.